I'm Sasha. You guys are watching Mini PC Pro TV, and today I'm going to show you some exclusive hands-on on the new cloud from GOS. So that's the first cloud computing operating system on the market. It will be launched in January, I guess, for CES. But we saw David Liu from ThinkGOS.com already yesterday on the Netbook World Summit in Paris, introducing us the new cloud. So well. Let's just take a look at it and you would see how quickly cloud boots up. There it goes, there is the first cloud and here we are. So what do we have over here is just a browser. It's just a browser. But the guys over at GOS put some really fancy features into this. Well, first of all, as you can see, it's a Google Chrome. What we have over here, uh, look, they even were able to blend in uh, uh, the volume volume button so that you can change the volume of the system. You can see the battery status. It's 18% right now. I'm using a Gigabyte M912 uh, with that system. And of course you have the time over here. And right down here is the so-called, I guess, icon dock or kind of icon bar or dock bar, uh, quick launch applications but only applications that are in the cloud. So what you can see over here is Google Reader, Google Docs, we have Google Calendar, Mebo as a chat client, we have of course Google Mail, Google Maps, YouTube, you can choose Blogger and uh, the link to the GOS website and of course we could boot our Windows system and shut up the system and over here we can also set up our Wi-Fi which is working at the place over here because I just have no Wi-Fi available. So what we have is really, in my opinion, the fundamental philosophy of a cloud computing operating system. Keep it simple. It is just a browser with some status information and over here I have all the links I need you know, to, to uh, get over to Google Docs, uh, use uh, my Google email and it is fast, it is small, it gives me everything that I need to go into the cloud to make uh, computing while I'm online, you know, as easy as it could be. So it's quite impressive to see a company coming up with such a simple operating system. So I'm pretty sure this will get onto the market very quickly and it should be pretty successful. Another little feature, just look how fast it shuts down. That's also something that I like. Bang! I don't know, a second? Not even a second. So this is all about having a minimal computer system, just an uh, uh, operating system, just a browser, and you know, keep it simple, keep it small, and I guess that that's what GOS is doing with cloud.